center, uh, which is a very important concept, especially uh, uh, to control the nonlinear and the robust system. So in this uh, particular presentation, I'm going to share you about the sliding mode control. So sliding mode control is one of the uh, robust, robust control. <clears throat> Sliding mode control is one of the uh, robust control, which is a, a higher order control system. Higher order control system. Again, which is uh, basically implemented for the nonlinear systems, for the nonlinear systems. Linear systems. So. <clears throat> This robust, I mean, uh, sliding mode control is uh, basically implemented for the nonlinear plant. Uh, la suppose uh, we have a plant, uh, our plant is, uh, 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 what do you call it, it's, uh, it's nonlinear or it's an unstable system or it's a high, higher order system, higher order system. We're going to implement the uh, controller uh, uh, for our uh, system before the output is uh, <coughs> obtained from a given system. For that matter, we have an input here, a control input here, and we have here a plant here. This is our plant. This is our plant or our system. So we have to put the plant system uh, mathematical modeling under heat, and we able to uh, implement the uh, SMS control. This SMS control is in order to linearize the nonlinear system by uh, certain uh, solving uh, techniques. So. This is a basic, a brief uh, introduction about the sliding mode control. So next, uh, what are the mathematical background of the sliding mode control? The sliding mode control is, uh, uh, let's say we have an linear system equation. We have x1, x1 equation, which is the uh, partial uh, differentiation or the partial derivative of x1 and the partial uh, derivative of x2 again here. So the for these uh, two systems we have uh, uh, the nonlinear uh, system or unstable system will be uh, <coughs> uh, uh, equated in the form of mathematical equation. So we have to uh, find out the control input. This uh, control input is uh, 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 calculated by the uh, SMS control mode. So this uh, control input is an input in order to uh, linearize this is an input u so this input u is uh, in order to linearize our plant here so we have here a sliding surface so our plant here uh, we have a sliding uh, surface here this is our sliding surface here i have x1 uh, and i have x2 here so for this x1 and for this x2, I have the sliding surface. This is my sliding surface and this is my trajectory for my trajectory here. So my point, uh, my trajectory, uh, the, uh, the, the linearization of as x1 dot x2 dot or any other x value, the state equation is came to here, starting from here, which, uh, which I have, let's say s greater than zero or let's say r is greater than zero. And uh, uh, the same is true starting from here and which is goes to here. So this is uh, 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 my sliding surface at s is equal to zero. This is s less than zero. So this is my sliding surface. When uh, the trajectory phase is came to here, starting from some particular point there and which came to here, uh, our target is in order to uh, take the system uh, trajectory to the equilibrium point. The equilibrium point means which is gonna uh, go to the origin here. So our target is in order to take this uh, trajectory or this path, this switching mode to this center, to this particular center. And this is also uh, after arriving here, which is uh, gonna uh, reach to the uh, uh, center here. So in some particular case, uh, in order to uh, regulate the system, here I have uh, the effect is the effect on and off uh, switch or on off case. In this on off case, 
I have a, some kind of noise. Some kind of noise will happen. So in a control algorithm, the very important concept uh, uh, is in order to reduce this noise. This noise, in the case of sliding mode control, we call it a chattering effect. Chattering effect so in order to uh, a chattering uh, effect in order to reduce this uh, chattering effect we have to implement another control algorithm uh, and additionally sms control plus in order to reduce this chattering effect or this noise or this disturbance here i have noise again here which is noise or disturbance during a switch a switch on and the switch off case so during this time, we have to uh, make our system smooth. The switching process in here is uh, on and off case. Let's say practically we have a relay here. A relay. Uh, we have a relay. So a relay uh, during the energi energizing period and uh, the non-energizing period, we have on and off positions. On and off position. And again, we have a neutral position here, any position. So. In this, during on and off uh, uh, situation, our uh, 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 fuzz is like to be like on. It is gonna up and again, it back, off, then on, then off, then on. So this particular uh, effect will uh, make the uh, chattering point. So in order to uh, reduce this uh, sharp corner onto a smooth case, or a smooth surface, we need to uh, bring a sliding mode control plus some kind of uh, 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 algorithm. What you call it, you know, adaptive algorithm, adaptive algorithm plus another case, what you call it as a super twisting algorithm, SMS controller plus a super uh, twisting algorithm. So this is an adaptive algorithm is a super twisting algorithm so there are another mechanisms in order to uh, reduce this uh, chattering on and off effect while you look in here so sliding mode control is a very important the nonlinear and the hot research area but the very common case in uh, most sliding mode control is a uh, what you call it this a uh, chattering effect so physically the system is uh, uh, in on and off position so during that position we have a noise so in order to reduce that noise or in, in order to reduce that disturbance uh, in generally in order to reduce this chattering effect we need to have uh, another implementation so-called adaptive algorithm or a super twisting algorithm so uh, if that is the logic behind uh, in the super i mean the sliding mode sms control so now uh, will uh, uh, compute a given a mathematical uh, model so we we have to take a given common uh, mathematical model let's say a bander polycation we have a bander uh, uh, bander fall uh, system model so a bander fall system model we have x1 and x2 so we have to take the depressed partial the first derivative of x1 and x2 and we have u u is restricted in a certain region uh, which is less than or equal to one so we have to compute uh, this uh, uh, for this system uh, by using the sliding mode uh, controller mechanism or solving or linearizing this nonlinear equation by using this sliding mode controller so let's start in the next video. So this is all about the introductory part of the sliding mode controller.